Today's June la 11th, 2012. Um, I'm at Wild Acres and today's Wednesday, our day off. Just to recap some of the things that's happened this week because I haven't really been in tune to uh, focusing in on what's been going on. Um, have been really having a battle this week with writing. Completely stopped on where I needed to go with Larry and the story. I have felt very inadequate, um, very confused, and I have still got this physical thing going on with probably the black mold. I don't, I'm not sure, but um, haven't really felt good. Haven't slept all for the last nearly week and a half. I've been here. This is a week and a half I've been here, um, so I would like to just share some things that's happened since I've been here. Storytelling week was last week, and I. I think I've said a little bit about it, but not a whole lot. Um, I did Monday night when I got here to Wild Acres in North Carolina, sweet, uh, um, little Switzerland, North Carolina. Um, I ended up going to a storytelling uh, seminar here and didn't even plan on it and absolutely love it. I'll tell more you about that later. Uh, Miss Betty actually came out of the character. Uh, she's a 100-year-old sex therapist. It's pretty cool. <laughs> she's born in 1912. Uh, this is 2012, so she's 100 years old. I don't know what day her birthday is. I have no clue. Anyways, a lot of fun. Uh, Monday night, out Monday was the day I went to the hospital, and then um, I come home Monday night, and then Tuesday I felt bad all day. Wednesday I felt bad all day, but I still went to classes. Did my first storytelling on Tuesday night, and I think I have that on video. Uh, uh, around the campfire on Ghost Story Night. Then Wednesday, I did a, I wrote a, um, a story during uh, lunch, and uh, actually right after lunch, about 30 minutes worth of writing, and I did that that night. Forgot what it was on. I have them all written down. And then Thursday was our concert, and so Donna Marie took us through the steps of characterization and visualization of your character so that night I, I did um, the uh, scene of resuscitating a 24 preemie born at home that was really awesome and then Friday we did a, a thing where we closed our eyes and we just imagined a character the voice of a character so we learned about the voice of a character not not the voices in first person second person ter third person but the voice of what they sound like, how do they move their mouth, how do they talk, what's their language, what's their dialect, are they southern, are they northern, are they, you know, whatever, are they an animal, are they a worm, or are they a crow, or whatever that is. So you pick the voice, and then we learned how to walk like that voice, and that's where Miss Betty came out. She's fun, man, she's so much fun. All last week, um, we also played music uh, with Steve uh, Doherty and we had a great night and I've got some of that on video too and so also I think I read two or uh, two or three times in student reading twice I think so tonight I'm uh, and um, so that's what happened last week it was very nerve-wracking to get up there and do your concert when you're not good you, you don't know what you're doing but I learned about sequencing and I did that and I, did, I wrote that in about 45 minutes too and then uh, of course Friday when um, Miss Betty came out we've got videos of that too you probably will never see those because my skirt's too short <laughs> doesn't show anything but still gained a lot of weight gained 10 or 10 pounds since I've been uh, going I've been on the road since June uh, 8th was my first seminar June 8th through the 10th was West Virginia 10th through the 15th was Hollins University in Roanoke Virginia 15th through the 19th was St. Simons Island in Georgia and then the 1st through the 14th would be in uh, little Switzerland North Carolina at Wild Acres Retreat we have no air conditioner here it's amazing the view is amazing it's been hot it's raining right now fog is horrible it's a beautiful place they have great food like I said, I've gained about 10 pounds through this finasco. I can't get into any of my clothes. 
So I'm going to give you an update so this one doesn't take too much longer. So if you want to check out what's coming up tonight or what happened today, then you best tune in. Okay.